It's the novel that changed the world. We love Harry Potter. 20 years ago, one small book about a young British orphan became a magical phenomenon. I've been reading them since I was 12 years old, and it's like part of my childhood and continues to be part of my childhood. In the movies, you get a good visual of the storyline. A kid finds out he's a wizard. I'm a what? Gets accepted to a prestigious school for magic. <laughs> and is pretty much like any other teen in high school. He becomes a fly athlete, sparks up a few wand tricks, You're a really good teacher, Harry. and oh yeah, spends the majority of his time trying to defeat a mysterious dark lord, whose name we can't really say on air. We do not speak his name. It's monumental for every one of this generation. I think um, it's instrumental for everyone's childhood. 400 million books sold, eight major movies, and two theme parks later. Revealio. It's hard to deny how much Harry's story has put a spell on readers worldwide. A little bit of magic, it's worth it. The story launched the careers of actors like Daniel Radcliffe and Emma Watson and made a struggling single mother a celebrity, one of the most influential authors of all time. I'm still receiving countless a huge amount of mail i thought it would really drop off by now but i'm you know stories drawings ideas suggestions that i write prequels and sequels i'm with every week now harry potter's story has traveled from the books and movies to the classroom putting a magical spin on required reading and influencing a lifetime of learning i didn't like english like to go to the class and everything but now i really like going to it because like we read harry potter when you first introduced harry potter to your students what was the reaction we don't read. That was their universal response. We're not reading. Um, they moaned, they cried, they just refused. Professor Lupin, right? Janet Tuthel is a ninth grade English teacher at Gaffney High School in South Carolina. When she first walked into the classroom, most of her students were not fans of reading, to say the least. Some students had a fourth grade reading level, even though they were freshmen in high school. How? Do these words apply to Harry? So Janet decided to change that with a swish of a wand. Sorry, a book. I think Harry Potter has changed the way we interact with literature. I think we demand now more than just a novel. Mm. We demand a world. J.K. Rowling created a brilliant world. Incantation or intention. The modern day professor McGonagall used the book to introduce her students to complex vocabulary, passages, and themes, then asked them to compare and contrast with other forms of literature. We review over what happened in chapters and we discuss like events that we thought stood out. Well, we talk about like like words and then we gotta find out the definition of them like some words that we really never heard about. Has the book inspired non-readers in your class to become bookworms? Um, the most memorable day this year was when one of my students walked up to me and said, Miss Tuthel, um, I haven't read a book since second grade, but I finished that one that we're working on and I need the next one because I have to know what happens. <laughs> and so I said, Okay, maybe we're getting somewhere. In this school, Harry's powerful story stays with students outside of the classroom, sparking a love for literature and an ambitious mindset. I think the most important lesson for these students is it doesn't matter where your life has been. Expecto Patronum! There's magic inside of you and you can make a change in your life. You can make your life different. Arielle Hickson, Channel One News.